I'm very excited today because I'm going to share with you a new item, the FPV cord. So you may ask, aren't me just focus, just focusing on photography, cinematography, or filmmaking? So how come this FPV? The reason is simple, because I'm preparing a film about certain kind of speedy sports. And I think even the traditional camera drone can offer me some very extraordinary sorts. So finally, I come to this FPV. So back to this FPV today. I'm going to share with you this happy model, Mobile 7 One S. This little drone is come with the Express LRS receiver. And actually, I've owned two Mobila 7 before. The first one is this, the regular one, the standard Mobila 7. It is a 1S to 2S drone. And I would say that I quite love this little hook because it flies well, it flies quite well and very fast. Of course, compared to those four inches or five inches drones, it may not, it may not be that fast. Because of its performance, I bought another one, this Mobile 7 HD. You can see that they are almost the same. The only difference is this Mobile 7 HD can suit Full HD internally. That's loaded for you to add an external camera, for example, the GoPro or uh, the, the 360 Go, something like that. It's loaded for you to add, add on any camera. It can record Full HD video internally. But it, tra but it trace off something um, because it's a little bit heavier than this regular Mobile 7. The speed seems a bit slower than this one. But still, it flies very well. And I think the video quality is enough for most of the social platform. So I also really love this little cord. And then it comes this Mobile 7. Okay, let us see what's inside the box first. Okay, there is uh, the spare props, two stickers, parallel charger, a spare canopy, and then it comes this Mobile 7 1S. At first, I don't intend to buy this one because I think 1S cord may be not so, not so powerful. But after watching the, the show wheel or the, uh, the promo promotion video from the Happy Model, I think the performance is quite good. The speed is okay. Not very really fast, but quite fast. And since it's with a long range receiver, of course the, the range could be a bit better than these this two previous ones because these two hoops just employed with a free sky receiver. Okay, so let us have a close look of this rope, little rope. You may see that the size is just the same, but it comes with a vibrate 40 mm props. So you can see that in searching for a much higher speed, they will sacrifice a bit of the top. And they've got a little motor for that. The RS0802, there's a 20,000 kV motors. And it comes with a all-in-one flight controllers. I quite love such kind of flight controllers because it's very convenient. The VTX is included inside. And the camera is the Runcam Lenovo 3. It's a very light in wing camera, just the same as the Mod 7. For this little hook, I will focus on five aspects. The first one, of course, is the smoothness of the flying performance. And the second aspect, I will try to study the speed. And the third aspect is the flight time. And the fourth aspect is the maneuver ability. Especially, I want to see the performance of the quick U-turn. Because quick U-turn is, is quite useful when, when I'm going to film those kind of speedy sports. And the final aspect will be the range. Actually, it's quite cold today. Oui. This is an X50 mAh battery. The Jumper T Pro controller. Okay, I'm testing its smoothness of flying. 
Yes, the frying is very smooth, very stable, and just out of the box PID tuning. Let's try the speed. My feeling is it's a bit faster than the Mod Light 7. Not as fast as the regular Mod 7. Okay, try again. The range test. Of course, you won't expect you can fly miles away with just tiny wood. Okay, right here. Right here is around 300 meters. I quite the signal. I think the signal is okay. But both the transmission or the radio signal is quite a bit weak. RF signal critical. And try the maneuver ability. Okay, quick U-turn. I would say that it didn't drift a lot. Yes, the first impression of this Mobila 1S is the fry is very smooth. The speed is not very high. In fact, compared to the original Mobila 7, it's a bit slower, but very smooth, very stable. Yes, the maneuverability and the, and those quick quick U turn is. Really good. I'm wondering if it can carry a 360 Go, a very light wing camera, so it can also perform certain cinematic filming. I would say that the video transmission is not bad. You can see that the, right now the, the signal is quite clean. Okay, this battery give me around five and a half minutes frying time. So will I suggest this Mobila One S to you? Yes, hundred percent positive.